ready to start thinking about the future. Speaking of which, hey, bro! Oh, uh. No, no, no. Don't worry, I got it. Sorry, I, I didn't mean to startle you. You're, you're the new B shift proby, right? Yeah. Uh, I mean, yes, sir. Just finished my first shift. Oh, <laughs> hey. Thought I might find you hiding in here. Hiding? No, not at all. I finished everything on Buck's checklist, mm -hmm. so I, you know, started thinking maybe I could earn some extra credit. So I uh, came in here and started tightening the screws on Capsule desk chair. Mm. I knew these heels would be the death of me. Well, you broke your ankle to avoid being crushed by a car. Take the win. We're just waiting until Chimney arrives. Mmm, delicious. You put that back right now. You hear that? Somebody, please. Somebody help me, please. See? Hello? You got. Or maybe we'll find someone else already there. Feeding us to it. Is that Proby? Guys! I found it! That's five million divided by eight. I'm not doing any more math. Don't move. We're coming to get you. Hurry, please. I don't even want to think about what I'm sitting in. Guess someone's going into the sewer. I'm going into the sewer, aren't I? Not sure that's possible. Drain pipe's only three inches. I saved a baby in a pipe once. Although it was a preemie, it, it didn't speak. Aren't you glad you're not a recruit anymore? Good to see you, Robbie. <laughs> uh, it's peer group instructor Pontycard. Right. I heard that. I thought it was the right thing to do. I have to go with him. No. He's coming back, back. With Maddie. When he dies, you're going to be right here. He's not with us. Now, can we please eat? You guys are so weird. <laughs> Wheels could probably use some WD-40 when we get back to the station. Have you seen these workout mirrors? So crazy. Stay Super focused. Crazy. Uh, how was it? No, pretty quiet. Whoa! Did, did, did he just say? No. Sorry, I just said it was. Don't say it again. Hold on, hold on. I don't know. Maybe if he says it a second time, it undoes the curse. Maybe if he said it a third time, the Candyman will show up and kill us all. Let's not test uh, the theory. That word is forbidden in the firehouse. Any house, we we just we don't use the Q word. Who used the Q word? What am I missing here? Rick, he was dead when we got here. We didn't kill him. We just wanted to. Buck, you're new. Yeah, I'm not really with them. Uh, I barely know these people, so. Detective. Yeah, we got this. Where you can open the door with one hand, and grab the ram with the other in one fluid motion like so. This motorized gurney is awesome. The reshift guys never let me use it. It's because it's not a toy. Stop playing with it. Brody, I said stop playing with it. What did you do? Where's that gurney, Buck? Uh, small technical issue with that, Cap. What kind of issue? Oh, oh Ravi, this is uh, my son Christopher. Chris, this is Robbie Panikar. You're a firefighter? I'm what they call a probationary firefighter. Did you do something wrong? Constantly. <laughs> I'm Anna. Hi. Hi. <laughs> you must be Eddie's wife. You've never been here. Um, no, I haven't. Uh, Proby, uh, why don't you take Anna on a tour? Huh? I'm gonna put this stuff up there. And we don't want these things to wilt. Come on. <laughs> Show y'all around. Come on, Chris. Uh, I wonder how many dumb treasure hunt calls we're gonna get today. I know. It's been crazy, right? I think we had four yesterday. Uh, oh yeah? <sighs> what were they? Oh, well, you know, there's a homeless guy talking about... You sent me to the academy to bring the kid back, didn't you? Hey, you're a great teacher, Chief. I finally give you your review on behalf of... Hey, what was the deal with Eddie at the bar the other night? He was there. I didn't see him. Uh, I texted him. I just I thought it was a no-show. Well, I saw him in the parking lot, and he just kind of blew me off. Weird. Yeah. I wonder what's going on. 
You took a chopper to Vegas? Uh, and how was the fight? The fight was okay. Seats were amazing. Tommy's buddies with the promoter, so we were ringside. Felt like I was the one throwing the punches. Who's Tommy? Fuck. Uh, you spot? Uh, no. Good things. <sighs> How are we looking down there, Robbie? Vitals are good. No sign of spinal or TBI. Splinting leg now. Listen, I think it's great. You know, you can't have enough friends, right? Right. You know, it's like that thing when you meet somebody and just click. You know what I mean? I do. I really do. Uh, so when do you think you'll see him again? He's got this karaoke bar trivia thing on Wednesday. What are you doing Wednesday? Me? Uh, yeah, no, I'm, I'm free. Uh, totally free. Wednesday is a clean slate. Great. You think you can watch Christopher for me? I asked my soul, but she's already done it twice this week for me. Uh, yeah, I do that. Thanks. I owe you one. Hello? I'm still down here. I thought we were having Mexican tonight. Yeah, cops switched it up. He didn't want to trigger me so soon after you turned my gurney into a taco. Still can't figure out how you did it. I didn't even know it could bend like that. And I'm not finished yet, pure instructor panty car. What, you're gonna test me now? Okay, I'm, uh, I'm just working out how to do this. Just like that, I guess. I can still smell it. It's like burnt in my nose. It's called phantasmia. Brain recreates smells even when they're not present. I'm not waiting a minute longer. I don't need all the hoopla. Just Maddie and G, it's all I'm really up. happy to be here. It doesn't yeah, seem so bad. Uh, probably be a good partner. What are you doing? Look, I just want it noted, for the record, I did say that was probably a bad idea. Oh, God. A chainsaw must have hit him not to cuss if he kicked back so hard. Buck, Robbie, we're gonna need to remove that blade from the motor. Oh, I, I don't think Robbie, I... if you're gonna vomit, do it somewhere else. <laughs> Copy. That's right, you did warn me. And wouldn't it be funny to teach me a lesson? What do you mean? I'll drop the innocent act, Pony Car. You took it. What? You're sure you're not injured, sir? No, I'm fine. How about you come outside and just let me check you for injuries, just to be safe? Nope. These guys probably planned this whole little prank and left you out of the loop. We do it all the time. Good to know. What are you doing here? Gerard, I feel like I should be asking you the same question. I'm captain of the 118. No. Yes. There was some concern downtown. I left the firehouse with the ring and I put it in that bag which you were all witness to. The same bag that you all had access to, but no one with more access than my partner. Robbie, why don't you do the honor since you were here first? It wasn't as heavy as I thought. I'm guessing it's just the check, not the actual jewels. I mean, we'd be dumb enough to do that, right? You have got to be kidding me. My job here is for the younglings. Feel comfortable laying their burdens down on someone who's closer to them in rank and age. No back. Yes, sir. You're behind. Get up on that ladder and get that hose on that fire. Yes, sir. Come on, double time. So you create the burdens for them to lay on you. That's how it works? Well, you gotta keep them sharp. After your requisition form has been submitted, you will be issued a personal charging device. Once it is dead, you return it to the Proby charging pool and it will be recharged for you. You could just say Robbie. Robbie will recharge it for you. One charge per 24 hours is the limit. Well played. So let this be a lesson. Never give Buck a clipboard. Never. Excuse me for being efficient. That's one word for what you are. Look, don't beat yourself up, Chim. I'm not great at doing my taxes either. No one is. But uh, I am. Seriously? Okay, fine. I was hiding from Buck. I needed a break. Please don't tell him I'm in here. <laughs> don't worry. I'll protect you from Buck and his chainsaw. But there's a chainsaw? Thanks. We had a time. Okay, that is a beautiful man. Where's the lie? And I like girl. Okay. Three minutes? <laughs> How the hell did you manage to shave almost three minutes off of Buck's best coffee run time? It's called a mobile order, Ann. Walked in and the drinks were waiting. This just better be oat milk. Damn it, he even got the order right. 
Based on my past, Taylor and I have reached a point in a relationship where the woman flees. Women flee you? <laughs> Routinely? She needs to wash her hair or do her laundry, and before you know it, dropping them off at the airport and never seeing them again. Okay, Buck, you Taylor is not Abby or Allie. He doesn't even rhyme. I mean, that's a good sign, right? The thing is... Have a good one. Rob. Thanks. You too. Hey. I just wanted to say I'm honored that you picked me to fill your shoes. Really? Yeah. But I'm glad I don't have to. I like being me. Apparently, May walked in on him and Athena reconnecting in the kitchen the other night. Oh, God. Parental nightmare. Well, apparently my wife has been oversharing. I mean, I just wasn't aware that we were able to bring our gear home for recreational purposes. Ah. <laughs> You've been playing sexy firefighter, Cap? What makes you think that I was the firefighter? Oh, <laughs> come on. I live here now. Oh, we love having Shim on the B side, or uh, as we like to call it, the A plus side. Ravi here is the double shift king. Maybe not for long. Well, I have an excuse. I'm saving up to buy a property. Oh, nice. Uh, first condo? My third apartment building. What? That's how you build generational wealth. Hey, Hen! Chimney! Thought you guys were off today. Yeah, we are. And what are you doing here? <laughs> and what's with all those non 2 ms Oh, we were just uh, working on a special project for the mayor. Oh, seriously? Well, what kind of project? Beta testing a new piece of equipment for us to use in the field. We just needed to uh, go over some of the data from our transfer forms. need data. Data? <sighs> Sounds official. Well, we better get going. The mayor's office is going to want that report ASAP. You're a terrible liar. You're too good. What do you think they're hiding? Around here, I find it's best not to know. There's really no reason why you shouldn't, Jim. Unless you plan on buying a duplex. Enjoy it while it lasts. That's my motto. Hey, Ravi, you know you don't have to eat everything at the buffet, right? Why else would I be here on my day off? Hey, look who I found. Hey, hey. Ravi's back. Hey, hey. 